Hey guys, in today's video I'll be showing you my updated optimization match. This patch is made to increase your FPS, lower your overall system latency, and also decrease your input delay in any game that you play. If you enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe as I will be posting videos every Saturday at 1 p.m. East. But yeah. Now to get this tool, the first thing you want to do is join my Discord server, link in the description below. Once you join my Discord server, you want to head over to the optimization match channel and then scroll up and you should see the github link for it. This will take you to the github page of my optimization batch. Once you're in here, you could click Ansel's performance batch.bat right here. And this will show you the source code of my batch. I keep the source code transparent because I don't want anybody thinking that I'm doing something suspicious in here. And also so you guys can educate yourself as I do post notes on what each of these commands do. But yeah. To actually download this thing, you want to head over to releases right here. You want to click on it, and then at the time you're watching the video, the batch might be updated to a different version, but it doesn't really matter as long as it has the latest tag right here. And to download it, all you have to do is click Ansel's Performance Bat .bat right here. Now, for some of you guys, you might get like a virus detected or a malicious file detected. If that's the case, this is because this batch disables Windows Defender and Windows Defender could read that code. So if you want to keep it, you could right click it and there should be like a keep option right there. Another thing too is if you go into your downloads, it might have like a keep option right here too. So that's what you should do if it says virus detected or something. Now the second thing we're going to do is download Power Run. What Power Run allows us to do basically is just run my batch with the highest permissions. Without proper admin permissions, some of the tweaks may not be ran and only half of the batch may apply. So you want to use Power Run to make sure everything gets applied properly. To do this, you would head over to my Discord server, which will be linked in the description below. Then go to Programs and then Pin Messages. In here, you want to click on the Sortum link and this should download Power Run for you. Now that power run is installed, you want to open it, and then you can close out of Chrome. And then what you want to do is extract it, so you can just drag it to your desktop. Now that you have power run on my batch installed, what you want to do is right click my batch, and run it as administrator normally. If it runs properly like this, then you're fine, close it because we haven't ran it with power run yet. If you do get a Windows Smart Screen pop-up, it should look something like this. You want to click More Info, and once you click More Info, there should be a Run Anyway button. And then the batch should open, and then you want to close it, just because we didn't run away Power Run yet. To run away Power Run, it's pretty simple. All we gotta do is open the Power Run folder right here, and then you want to hover over my batch, and then drag it on top of the Power Run.exe one right here. Not any of these, just the Power Run.exe. Once you're in here, you can click run if you get this pop-up. And then the batch should run by itself. It's going to ask you if you want to create a restore point. I'm just going to press no. And then in here, you'll get access to my tweaker, which, as you see, has a bunch of options right here. The ones I really recommend the most is performance optimizations, keyboard optimizations, and disable telemetry. If you also go into the Deep Low Windows channel right here, you should see Disable Unnecessary Services and a bunch of other Deep Low options right here, which are pretty useful. Another thing too is if you go into the other tab, you'll see a bunch more system specific options right here. KBoost, this is GPU related, it has to do with locking your GPU clocks to the highest speed that they could probably go. Disable Drivers, this just disables some drivers. Power plan, this will import my power plan. I'll put a benchmark on the screen right now that'll show you the benefits of doing this. And run OOSU, it just basically runs ONO shut up, which will disable some telemetry and fix up windows a little bit for you. But yeah, this is how you would use my tweaker. If you want to do anything, you just type the number and click enter. Make sure you run away power run so everything gets applied properly. If you do get any errors, those are inevitable. I can't hide all of them, but that's just how the program works. If you use my program and you want to rate your experience with it to let other people know, feel free to head over to the Velcher channel on my Discord server and let people know how the tweaker worked for you. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you want to see any more content or have any specific suggestions on what you want to see, let me know in the Discord server. But yeah, see you in the next one.